Hi there. In this video, I am going to demonstrate how to add my digital assignments that are made as fillable slides to your Google Drive. There are two different ways to add digital assignments to your Google Drive, and I'm going to demonstrate this process with my free unit of homework assignments. My digital assignments that are fillable slides are made with Microsoft PowerPoint, and they are PPTX files. These files open and work seamlessly with both Microsoft PowerPoint and Google Slides. There is no reformatting that needs to be done regardless of the program that you desire to work um, in or have your students work on these assignments in. So I've already downloaded this unit of homework assignments. The default download location for both Mac and Windows computers is the download folder. And when I open this up, um, my zip file is actually automatically decompressed on my Mac computer. If it didn't automatically decompress, I'd have to double click the zip file to um, decompress it, which would uh, extract a folder that has another folder with the digital assignments and a PDF file that includes the printable version of that resource with the answer key. If I was working on a Windows computer, this would be a file that ends with .zip. I would right click the file and find the option for extract all to get a result that I'm looking at right here. So the first way I'm going to demonstrate how to uh, add these uh, digital assignments to your Google Drive is by actually uploading the folder with the folder upload tool in Google Drive. So to do this, I'm gonna go to new and I'm going to select folder upload. So I may choose this option if I want to retain the organization of having all of the digital assignments in a folder. Um, from here, I could download just the, or excuse me, upload just the digital assignments or the folder that includes the printable resources as well. It's up to you and your personal preference. Um, I'm gonna upload just the digital assignments, so I chose this folder. I'm gonna click upload, and I'm gonna give Google Drive uh, just a few moments to upload this folder. There's only five digital assignments, and then there's a sixth file um, that's just directions for the digital assignments. So I'm gonna give that some time um, to finish uploading. And once it's finished, um, I know that it's done because there's a green check mark. I want to rename this folder, so um, I'm going to right click it, click rename, and I just want to uh, better um, label the contents of this folder. When I click this folder, I see that there are five homework assignments. When I click the assignment, the editable area is just the text box. Uh, students should not be able to edit the questions or the directions. Uh, the only area that students should be able to manipulate, as well as the teacher, is the text box. Um, so that's how you can add uh, digital assignments using the folder uh, upload tool. So this is a nice option um, if you want to retain organization um, within your Google Drive, uh, if you want to use the organization I have in place, and if you own maybe several homework assignment resources or bell ringers, labs, um, this may be a nice option for you. Another way you can add uh, digital assignments to your Google Drive is by simply dragging and dropping files into your Google Drive. So um, all you have to do for that is select the files. So I am selecting all five digital assignments here. And I know these are digital assignments because they are PPTX files and they say fillable slide. I'm going to drag them into my Google Drive and then I'm going to allow it some time for these files to upload into my drive. Just like with the folder, I need to wait for the green check mark to appear um, next to all the files to know that they're fully uploaded. The more files you have, the longer it's gonna take. 
and when I click each one of these uh, files, I can see that I have the same accessibility that's expected with a digital assignment. So I hope this video better helps you understand how to access the digital assignments in your Google Drive. If you have any questions or concerns, please send me an email at dsj.elkowitz at gmail.com.